Hello YouTube, this is Joey. I'm just doing a quick um, vlog vlog for Vlogtober. Uh, you're supposed to do one vlog a day, which will be quite a feat if I can accomplish that. Since I'm uh, notorious for starting something and never finishing it online. So, <laughs> um, or at least not keeping up with it. I start it, I don't have a finish to it, and then I don't keep up with it. So, uh, today's vlog is going to be about uh, vlogging or vlogging or however you pronounce that word. I don't know how to pronounce it. Uh, it's not something that I've really done very much of in the past. I've done a few response videos and that's about it. Um, so I'm like struggling to think of a topic. So I guess I'll just talk about vlogging in general. Uh, it hasn't caught on as much as I thought it was going to c catch on. Uh, it's starting to catch on a little bit now but uh, back when YouTube first came out that was like oh video vlogging that's gonna be it's gonna totally replace blogs and uh, blogs will go away and vlogging is the wave of the future and that has certainly not been the case up until very recently I think just maybe this year um, it's starting to gain in popularity I know there's been some vlogs out there previously but it just seems to me in my own personal life that vlogging has just now started to take off so um, there's that and uh, I would uh, note that blogging has died away but I think uh, that's as a result of Twitter and Facebook and the new mobile devices and things like that that uh, make Twitter and Facebook uh, the way people access the internet now so I think a lot more people access the internet now through their phones than uh, and, and small devices uh, rather than uh, through the computer so blogging has kind of died off uh, there's just, um, not nearly as much uh, full-length blogging going on it's you know mostly just Twitter and Facebook and things like that with uh, they're still blogging out there, but it's it's um, supplemental information. Basically, somebody's like, uh, "Hey, let's make a website about fighting breast cancer or something like that," and um, they post it on their Facebook and they post it on Twitter and all this talk about it on on those formats. And um, the blog, they might put a blog up about it, but they might post to the blog once a month and do most of their their. Uh, uh, talking about whatever topic they choose through Facebook and Twitter and other social media things like YouTube so um, and through vlogging and, and other things like that so uh, it's a little bit sad I think um, that blogs have have gone downhill a little bit I mean there's still some great quality blogs out there um, but uh, there's some really shitty ones out there now too, and a lot of them have just died off and aren't aren't really uh, as uh, active as they used to be. I know my own blog; I kind of closed up shop on it in 2009. I think I've posted one thing on that blog. Uh, I also did like a running slash health related blog uh, when I first started uh, running, and. Um, I go through spurts. When I'm running, I feel like posting to it. When I'm not running, uh, I don't feel like posting to it. So um, uh, a lot of that has to do with my own personal moods and things like that. But um, I, I think that as a platform, blogging is is kind of descended a few notches, and it'll continue to descend into a death spiral that. Uh, it'll never fully go away. People will continue to, to do blogs and stuff like that, but uh, the short length uh, Twitter tweets and, and Facebook posts and YouTube uh, vlogs and things of that nature, I think, are going to uh, ultimately replace blogs, and I think they're now coming into their own. So uh, here I am doing a vlog. And I'm going to do one every day for 30 days, or 31 days, for October. And then next month, I'm going to do a thing called uh, 
uh, NaNoWriMo uh, stands for the National National Novel Writing Month, which is November. And um, so you get 30 days, the month of November, to write an entire novel. Uh, I can't remember. I think it's like 15,000 words or something like that you have to write. I've never written a novel. I've written some short stories, but I have not written anything of substance in, wow, probably since the year 2000, so, or before. <laughs> so, um, it's been a long, long time since I've written anything other than, uh, like, non-fiction uh, blog posts. So, uh, any fiction that I've not written any fiction probably in the 2000s in this millennia so <laughs> it's um, gonna be quite a feat for me to go through this I'm gonna start thinking of some plot ideas and uh, I already have kind of one I've got like three or four that I'm kind of tossing around uh, I've got one in the back of my head right now that I'm thinking about uh, but if when it comes down to it I might just go with uh, doing a, a, a fictional memoir I think that would probably be uh, a little bit easier than trying to uh, dream up a whole story from start to finish you know um, and try to wrap everything up and, and make it make sense and things like that because real life uh, even if it's a fictional real life it's still a lot easier to, to do that because you things don't have to make sense they you don't even have to go in order you can talk about this and then say you know well ten years before I did this and then go back and forth so uh, I think that would be kind of the easy way out uh, but it might be a, a good way to do it because this will be my first time doing it so anyway you can check that out at uh, just Google NaNoWriMo or National Novel Writing Month and uh, you can check that out. So that's two big projects uh, come for this uh, for me. <laughs> um, uh, who I'm not good at big projects, uh, but um, that's just the way it goes. So that that, and then I've got something else coming up in December, which is not fully fleshed out yet. So. Uh, I guess I'll talk about that later in the month when I do have it fully fleshed out. Anyway, uh, that's my first vlog for the month and one of my very first vlog vlogs ever, uh, especially one that's talking about me personally. So, uh, peace out. Have a good day. <laughs>